In tonight's On the Road, CBS's Steve Hartman has the story that expands the definition of being a good neighbor and what it means to be family. Days don't come much worse than this. Is it your husband? Yes. In January of 2021, Jean LeVar's husband of 58 years died in their home. And when the Glendale, Arizona police entered the building, they found such terrible living conditions, they had to condemn her house. So all in one day, you lose your husband and you're homeless. Mm -hmm. Did you expect what would happen next? No, that was a surprise. Carmen Silva happened next. She lives across the street. And although she barely knew those neighbors, when she learned that Jean had no kids or family to turn to. I told her, don't worry, Jean, we're going to fix it. You know, it's one thing to be neighborly, but you've taken it to the extreme. I don't see that. You don't see that? Mm -mm. I've always taught my kids to take care of their elders. So, even though the Silvas live in a small three-bedroom house with eight children, they made room for one more. The boys gave up their bed to sleep on the couch, eagerly welcoming their new adopted grandmother. She looks very happy, and I believe it's because she has a whole family now. Do you feel like you found a family, mm -hmm. finally? Mm -hmm. It means everything, just thinking about it. There's nothing better than a loving home, except maybe to cut the ribbon. two loving homes. A nonprofit called Operation Enduring Gratitude, which helps Arizona veterans and their families, heard about Jean's plight. And since Jean's husband was a Navy vet, volunteers went full speed ahead, renovating her old house. We're all joining together to do one thing, and that's to make somebody's life whole. The house is condemned no more, and it's all hers and hers alone. But Jean plans to share it with the Silvas, because that's what families do. Steve Hartman, On the Road, in Glendale, Arizona.